Hi there, this is Richard Burkhart, otherwise known by some as the Web Optimist. Um, I recently upgraded my wireless connection in my home office and home network to the Wireless N by Linksys, the WRT350. I'm trying to hold it up there so you can see the box. I bought this through Amazon.com. In the past, I've had really great luck with Linksys products. I started out with their wired routers years ago, moved up to the wireless B, then to the wireless G. In fact, my most recent was the WRT54GS, and this is what that baby looked like. This one was bulletproof. I rarely had any connection problems with it. Once every six months or so, I might have to go power it down and then power it back up. But for the most part, it was great, wonderful. So I bought the wireless G, I mean the wireless N, the, uh, the new wireless N by Linksys, paired it up with the wireless N USB network adapter. So I definitely have two compatible products uh, working together. My office is in one room. The main internet connection is about 20 feet away in another room with one, wa with one wall between us. Um, I hooked it up, looked promising, good speed. The range was not as good as I had hoped it would be, but you know, it looked like it would be workable. The problem was my main computer that, that this is all connected to wirelessly, uh, my work computer would lose the connection several times a day. I mean, right in the middle of something, I'd lose my connection. That won't work for me. I have uh, I do internet uh, work, internet marketing, search engine optimization, and so forth. All of my communication is by voice over IP, instant messaging, uh, email, so forth and so on. I can't have this going out on me during a business call. Just can't do it. Uh, I reconnected the wireless G, went to the Linksys forums, discovered a lot of other people were having similar problems, and the only way I could get this to get any kind of reasonably stable wireless connection uh, was to replace the software that came with it with a uh, third party product. Of course, that voided my warranty, but it was the only way I could get this to work for me. Uh, that said, I, you know, the other features to this router are a, uh, one of the other features is that you can connect it to a USB hard drive. So it's got a plug on the back of it. Uh, by voiding my warranty and using the other software, that's not going to work for me, at least not at this point. My recommendation is, if you are looking for something with a really stable connection, uh, some people have used this without a problem, but there are a lot of people out there who have the same problem I've been having. Uh, wait until, um, well, one thing, buy something else, or you can wait around and see if Linksys is going to come up with an up grade for the software. Um, until that happens, I can't recommend the product. It's just too unstable as far as the wireless connection. So that's my take on it, uh, on the Linksys WRT350N. Um, that's my review, so thanks for watching. Bye.